guys welcome back to till vacuum do us part so last week i put up like a mom life video or you know just getting it all done and you guys really seem to enjoy it so we're gonna do it again today i'm gonna go ahead and get started by working on this house a little bit we have a mess i have laundry we've got a homeschool we need to declutter so let's get right on into it Okay, so I've been keeping a towel down here. Sometimes it's a blanket. Right now they're all in the washer, so I just put this towel down here. But I'm learning if I keep that down there, they are less likely to get on the furniture. Now, I don't mind if they're on it, but George is just wild right now and has really sharp claws, and he's sometimes, like, messes with the fabric. So, if I put this down here, they seem to be pretty content, and the toys. But they're doing good right now. But now we're going to head into the schoolroom to get our school day started. Okay, and real quick before we start homeschool, I wanted to mention one last time that we use WebRoot as our like Wi-Fi security. So this is for times that you're not at home on your like secure network, which is a lot. I know a lot of us moms, while we're shopping, our kids are at dance or on the playground, we're like buying stuff online, we're on our phones, and I just feel like we can get hacked so much easier now, especially if you're working from your laptop. Um, if we're in hotels, I'm using like hotel Wi-Fi. It's just not secure it's not safe so if you're needing anything like that definitely check them out I'll have their link down below in my description box Okay, Savannah's taking a short homeschool break, so I just kind of wanted to show you the office and what it's looking like, what we're thinking about doing, what we want to do. So, I'm really liking both of these chairs in here. I like to have extra seating because if Chase is working, if I'm working, if Savannah's working, I feel like we need extra seating, especially when we have people over. Sometimes, like, the girls hang out in here. I don't know. I just like having extra seating. I like how this, like, frames my window right here. Can anybody else see a beautiful Christmas tree right here? <laughs> because I totally can. Um, I have this being currently used at my desk, and I love it. I am going to have to get a new chair. I feel like I've just worn this one out. Like, I just feel like all the cushions gone because I sit there so much. My back's really starting to hurt. So, I'm going to start looking for a nice chair for that. And then I think what we're going to go ahead and do is order two more of these, which we're going to get one of these that has like a filing cabinet in it. Um, Chase likes organizing like some of our paperwork, but basically it's going to be these same two things from Ikea, a long top, and we're going to put it over here. So I'm just using this to make do until we can get it in. And then I'll have all those drawers full of storage. I think I'm going to do, you know, like all my makeup in one and maybe jewelry in the other. And I think that's just going to look so much better than if, and I'll have to get a chair for there or a stool or something, then I can work over here and somebody else can be working over here because we have a laptop and the top will be cleared off. So we'll actually have two desks. 
and this will be serve as my vanity and a desk so I think that's gonna work out really well I want to get some type of rug I don't know if I want a furry rug I don't know if I want like a design rug but I'll have to do that I'll show you this side of the room real fast so you can get an idea I still have pearl there I've got to work on my closet um, a lot of you guys gave me suggestions for the shoes I probably need to get ordered, pants, I don't know. It's a hot mess, but it's functioning for now. This definitely is like a work in progress. And then I went ahead and put my mirror on this wall, so I'll have to find a different place for the necklaces. But I just wanted to give you a heads up. I think we're going to be doing some shopping tomorrow. So I kind of want to do some Christmas shopping so things don't start running out. And then I also want to get a few pieces for this. Now some of it's being ordered. But I really want to go to like Big Lots. Maybe like in a Tulsa like um, home goods type store. I want to go to the big like at home store and look for a few pieces in here. So that should be all in tomorrow's vlog. I haven't filmed it yet because we'll be shopping in the next couple days and that will be Thursday's video but if I'm correct <laughs> that will all be in tomorrow's video so make sure you're subscribed on the Ashley and Chase channel so you don't miss it okay but now it's laundry time so I'm gonna go ahead and get that going Oh, I was in here grabbing my laundry basket and I forgot I haven't got to talk to you guys about my artwork yet. I mean, I talked about it in the sponsored video, but oh my goodness, we are loving it. I almost want to put it in my beauty room, but I love it and here too much to even move it. So I just think it fills up this wall so nicely. I know there's a terrible glare on it, but we love having something on this wall, but it's not like cluttered. It's not crazy. Um, I am going to have to get some new pillows while I'm out because the ones I had in here, I'm using in my beauty room right now. So I just threw that one in here for now. That's the laundry I need to work on. But this area, oh my goodness. Let me pull this out of the way. I think this is perfect. I've always looked at this spot and it's been so empty, but it's like, what do I put here? Um, if you started following me from the very beginning, this is where my vanity was. I had like a small little table and my light. So you guys can definitely put those in your master bedrooms if you have, you know, want them, but don't have an extra bedroom. Um, but since then it's like a weird spot. I didn't want two dressers and I don't like a lot of stuff. I'm just so happy with how this turned out. This is a fake plant from Kirkland's. Um, this was, I think, in like the pet or kids section at Home Goods, but it's just the perfect size. I don't know. This spot makes me so happy to wake up to. I feel like it's perfect. It's not cluttered. So yeah, I'm super happy with the way this room turned out. But back to real life, I have to do our laundry. <laughs> womp womp. <laughs> sure is going to be watering the plants i'm telling you guys if you want a plant i think you can keep it alive i seriously haven't watered my plants in probably two two and a half weeks and they look just fine but while i'm thinking about it i want to just go ahead and get it done so that's what i'm doing next
I'm like windblown. <laughs> Something made me look outside and I noticed our neighbor's trash was out. And I was like, did they put it out too early? And then I heard the trash car truck. I tried to set up the camera. I don't think I got it done when I first ran out there, but I like ran the trash can out there. Um, Chase never forgets to do the trash. Um, that's like his job, I'd say. I just don't think to do it. He always does it. We have been so busy lately. Like, I feel like we're in this phase of life. We're just like surviving. Even the video that went up today, you guys are loving it, but there were so many errors with it that I'm like, I didn't even catch that. I didn't even, I don't know. It's just a lot's going on. Um, life will be slowing down here in a few weeks, but just lately it's just been busy. And I was like, oh my gosh, I don't think he's ever forgot to put the trash out. But luckily I caught it. So we don't have to go another week without the trash service. We're kind of trash people, so we need it to be emptied. So, and then, I don't know what I got in the clip, but if you saw us looking at something in the middle of the yard, we have a turtle that comes from our back pond. It comes all the way through our backyard, through our front yard, and then goes over to our neighbor's house, which is a long journey for that little thing. I can see him right now, he's walking, but that's what we were looking at. Okay, now I'm on to my next chore of the day. I'm gonna go ahead and work on this. Obviously, it's not super crazy, but it's not super organized. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull everything out and work on it and just make it look nice and tidy. I did pick these up. I need to open them up at um, Home Goods yesterday. I've been curious about trying these out. I think I'm gonna cut it in half. You guys know I have a thing for cutting sponges in half, but it'll fit on my stand better. But I'm curious if these will last a ton of better. You can like throw them in the dishwasher. They don't scratch. And then I can stop going through these like crazy. So I'm also gonna try these out. I'll let you guys know. I got them from Home Goods and it was $6.99 for three. And if I can cut them in half and then they last forever, they say you can use them in bathrooms too. Um, I definitely am gonna try it out and I'll let you guys know what I think about them. But let's get to going on this. I'm going out my mind. Give me some directions to get to you. To get to you. Ain't gonna waste my time. I know that we got connection, I think about you You're on my mind, on my mind, on my mind Yeah, I'm going out of my mind, out of my mind, out of my mind yeah. For you, my love You drive me crazy, tell me what to do, what to do I'm on my knees, yeah, I am begging you Okay, I thought I'd show you what was kind of going on in here. So Savannah's been asking for a vanity, um, but they're kind of pricey. So I just took the half of the other glass desk and put it in here with my stool. Now I am gonna get her a mirror and maybe just like cheap bulbs that stick on it around. I don't wanna spend like, you know, they're pretty pricey for the kind I have. Um, but we can just do like a DIY version for in here. Plus there's no outlet in here. So it's going to have to be like battery operated, but I just think this is a fun little spot for a girl. She's going to organize some more of her makeup, but this closet's so nice. I definitely miss it, but she needs it, especially as she grows, but she can just like shut this off if she wants to and just have like a normal room. But when she wants to like, you know, feel grown up and as she starts getting ready more and more, like she's already started like doing her hair and lip gloss and all that, she just has a nice little pretty place to sit. So I think that's super cute and perfect. Like I said, we won't keep the long stand up mirror there. I'm gonna hang one, but I think that turned out really well.
Okay, George has been playing outside and he got in the pond. It keeps raining here. Luckily, it's from like the belly down. He's been playing it the last two days where he's like rolled in it. So I've given him a bath the last two days. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse him off. You can just tell he's white. So when he plays in the pond, his like legs are brown. Um, I'm gonna show you real quick how I do it because I got the coolest thing off Amazon. This is not sponsored, but I do have it in my Amazon store. So now we're gonna go bathe half of the dog. George, you gotta stop playing in it. See what I mean? Thank you, Savvy. <laughs> She's bringing me a tail. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Come back. Come back. Come back. I know you don't want it. He's getting sick of bass. But see what I mean by his paws. And they're stinky because it's from the pond out there. Okay, real quickly, this is the thing I wanted to show you guys. If you have to bathe your dogs at home, this is a game changer. I bought it off Amazon with my own money. I'll have it linked in there, but it has saved me so, so much. It just hooks up right here, and I love it. And it makes the towel cleaning even easier, too. George, did you have fun? Was it worth it? That's the question. Was it worth it? For you, my love. You drive me crazy, tell me what to do, what to do. I'm on my knees, yeah, I am begging you, begging you. I'll break the rules if it will get me to, get me to, yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing? He is why my floors never stay clean. <laughs> Can you see this? I don't know if they're showing up on camera, but everywhere he went. George, why are you acting crazy? So you can tell when I bathed him, I only did it from like the belly down. Well, first off, I just don't have it in me to do another whole bath and it's not good for their skin. Normally, I Normally I have a shampoo, but I didn't use that either. Like I said, I've bathed him the last two days, so I was just trying to get the gunk off him. He is super feisty now that he's had a bath. What are you doing? You guys see the calm version of George? There is a puppy version in him. Trust me, <laughs> this is my life. <laughs> Okay, it's actually 1.30, so we're having a really late lunch, but Savannah slept in to like 9.30. We had a late breakfast, we've had homeschool, I've been cleaning, George is acting super crazy today. So I just looked down and noticed it was 1.30. Luckily, we had Mazio's last night, um, so we had leftovers. So I'm just gonna heat up me and Savannah some pizza real fast. it's after lunch um, I've been answering a lot of comments on today's video and I get this question a lot so I wanted to answer it on here just in case you've ever wondered and haven't asked it or you didn't get my reply back or whatever but every time I'm doing laundry and I show myself putting in the detergent or softener with the water running you're always like what kind of washer and dryer do you have mine doesn't let me do that I think it's a new like safety feature if you put it on a bulk setting, see if you have like a bulk setting, it'll allow you to do that. I think it's because it's allowing you to put big items in while it's running. So that's my little tip for you. Check it, see if it works, but that's what I use and that's why I can like rinse out my little cups or lids while I'm starting the laundry. And then I have a question for you guys. I just asked this over on Instagram, but I wanna know from you guys too. It seems like these casual like Mr. Pumpkin's head just fell again. <laughs> that guy. 
<laughs> we're, about, we're almost through Halloween. That scared me though. You guys can probably see it in my face. So my question is, it seems like you guys are really liking these like casual stay in the home mom life cleaning videos. So it's cleaning, it's organizing, it's talking, it's just a life um, versus like my very professional, like cleaning, only cleaning voiceover and music. So let me know, do you still want one of each of these every week or do you want more of these mom life videos? Um, I can just do it where I do like two of the professional cleaning videos like every other week. So you have more of this like vlog, just like more realistic style. Definitely let me know what you're thinking, what you like, what you don't like, if you like both, if you want more of this, and then I'll just put up a few um, of the other style occasionally. Um, Cause I definitely wanna do what you guys like and it seems like these get better views. But let me know down below in the comments. Now like my family vlogs and shopping and finance and all that will still be on the other channel. This is still just cleaning, but it'll just be more like what I do as a stay at home mom and just around the house. It's more of a variety. To me, I prefer this and it's more fun. And I don't know, I can get a little more creative with it than just like cleaning the house over and over and over. It's like real life, like it's more realistic cleaning, but I will totally give you guys whatever you want. Um, I wanna make you guys happy. So just let me know down in the comment section. What do you wanna see? Do you want more of these? Do you like it the way it is? Um, yeah, just let me know, let me know. And it's empty again. I love this feeling at the end of the day, but why is it when I wake up in the morning, all three of these are back full? Is it just me? Like, I know some of you guys have like multiple kids though. That's what I don't get. I only have one, so I don't know why this thing gets filled up so easy, but it's empty and that's all that matters. And I have proof. <laughs> and it's about 2.15 and this is what my house normally looks like at this point of the day. I've got stuff I need to clean up from lunch. I need to just kind of fluff up from the toys again. I need to fold the laundry. I need to clean up in here. You're wondering why there's a trash can upside down. It, I just use it for filming. <laughs> so, and the cake platter, it's just depending on where I need the camera. I don't know. And then the other chair's not there because I'm about to use it to film the cleanup in here. So I should just use my tripod, but I don't. But now I'm gonna do a little mini cleanup. I always do it around this point of the day. And then again, before Chase gets home, but it's 2.15, so clean up again. George did it again. <laughs> Look at him, he's so dirty. Oh, this pond's gonna have to get fixed out here. We had just like put it off because it wasn't bothering us because we don't go back there. Tiger never plays in it. We didn't want to spend the money. And then George came. <laughs> I don't know to bathe him again or just it's absolutely beautiful outside if I just let him play longer and do it before bed because it feels gorgeous outside and he actually loves being outside. You can tell he was outside more in his first home. Oh boy, I just hate to like bathe him again and then send him out. George, what are you doing? Tiger, what is he doing? <laughs> Make him stop. Tell him no more. <laughs> Bless you.
Okay, this drawer is just becoming cramped. I had no intentions on decluttering it, but to get all my clean laundry in there, I'm gonna have to, so I'm gonna work on this real quickly. Okay, he came inside and got a bath. So this is what I like to use on him um, just to help not smell like a wet dog and I'm gonna brush him as well just so he is nice and fresh. <laughs> you ready for it? He likes getting brushed. I was gonna take you in here and kind of show you how I clean the bathtub out. This bathtub is only used for him. I think I've only been in here like a few times, but it does smell like wet dog in here when I get done bathing him, which has been often. So I just take um, my Dollar Tree cleaner and I just spray it around. I feel like this really just takes out the smell quickly because I feel like the smell is all in this and in the towel. So I'm gonna clean this rinse it out and then stick this in the washer and then we're good to go but what i like about this little nozzle you can control it so you can decide how much pressure needs to be on it so if you have a smaller dog you can do lower pressure um but then to clean the tub voila look at that super easy i don't have to scrub it it's like a nice little power wash so I feel like that's just the easiest way and I can just do it real quick and then it's ready to go for the next time. Okay, I'm about to start dinner. Um, Chase is running by Sam's Club. We haven't picked up our dinners for the week. We get most of them there because they're pre-made. I stick them in the oven for like 45, 50 minutes and yeah, done. But obviously it's already 5.15 so when he comes home I'm not going to want to wait like an hour to eat. So he is going to pick up a rotisserie chicken which I love. You can add it to like chicken and rice, all sorts of meals. But we're going to just eat the chicken tonight. And then if you're new, I always grab these a Bob Evans um, mashed potatoes. You just heat them up in the microwave. They are so, so good and cheap and easy to make. I also grabbed a Caesar salad. And then this is, um, once again, if you're like been around for a while, you know all this, but if you're new, I get these French style green beans right here. They are so yummy. But the trick is you add half a bag of this um, Italian dressing mix into it and your kids will love them. Like this is the only way I can get Savannah to eat green beans. They are so good. I love it that way. Um, so that's just a little chick trick. Definitely try this out. So you just use half a thing. So you would use two of these for a whole one if you use more than one. But I'm gonna go ahead and get this going. So when he comes in, the rotisserie chicken's already done and ready to go. And so I want this stuff ready. Okay guys, here is how dinner turned out. It's super easy, it just takes a few minutes. All you have to do is go buy Sam's. <laughs> <laughs> And nice fresh rotisserie chicken. <laughs> That's right. I mean, but why would you fix that? If for $4.99, yeah. you can get this whole, whole thing. Chicken. And it is so good. It is very fresh, very good. All I day. love that scan and go. I did that today. And scan just right there in the middle of the aisle. I just yeah. got my stuff and checked out and walked out of there. It was awesome. Easy peasy. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this here. Thank you so much for spending the day with me. I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope you got some cleaning motivation. If you like this style of video, definitely let me know down below in the comments section and like this video so I know to make more like them. 
I hope you have a wonderful week and don't forget about tomorrow's video on our other channel and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>